how are you doing i hope you're all doing well um here's the date as i put these videos together uh this is why i have been watching what our government officials are doing as it says right here they are they are off they're they're uh, at home okay right here this is last year okay this is last year they're working the dark areas is where they're working right here if you notice this year right here they took off for thanksgiving right here like anybody else would this is the house schedule right here okay you got that this is why right here it says right here every king and the men of the rich men of the earth and the bondmen hit themselves in the mountains and the caves okay it says down here why because god's wrath they know it's coming okay they know it's coming and i believe they know when it's going to be here and they're getting ready for it that's why, like I said, the schedule, and I show you other places in this video. This is where they're going, one of the places that they're going. If you notice, this is Israel even. This is Israel's doomsday bunker. The top officials that have been activated for COVID-19. This is their bunker, okay? And... As I have showed this before, it's just the same thing. Look at same article, same, 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 same heading. This is Cheyenne, Wyoming. As you know, this this is this came out COVID hoax for them to hide. This came out um, May. This is they activated it. Okay, May twenty fourth, they activated it. It's all staffed. We'll take shift staffing the command center. They just opened it and it's activated. Before it was just a skeleton crew there. Now it's all activated. So as I said, this is why I have been watching this right here and what they're doing. So this is going to be into the lead into my video. I think you. I hope you're all doing well. And uh, this is the lead in for my new video. It's going to be a little bit longer. Sorry. I love all your comments. I love you all. We're all watching and waiting together. And uh, hope you're all doing well. And uh, keep warm. Um, I would recommend get uh, some extra things. Um, just, I have extra things. I live in a cold climate. I have wood fire, wood stove, um, a small one. I've made videos on that. Last year I was warning people about getting stocking up on stuff. Uh, it's it's always you know to be prepared. Love you all. Mm. How's everybody doing? I hope you're all doing well. Um, as we do, we watch. We are all watching, and that's what we are called to do. Watch. We are waiting for our Lord and Savior. And uh, here's the date right here: seventeenth and eighteenth. High watch. Uh, my brother Vincent has videos on this. Seventeenth and eighteenth. I watch and uh, we're watching every day um, and yes watching this weekend I love you all but there's other days that we can look at too and that's what this video is about as we are watching as I said before here's the date house leaves for October recess without deal right here they left yes they are working from home but uh, unless they have an agreement, they're not going to come back and vote. And they are gone. As I showed right here on my house calendar right here, exactly what I said. The second they are leaving. Okay? The second. So they are gone. If you can see right here as I showed, um, they're gone all the way up to here. They only work one week in November. One week. So high watch. High watch. Why? Because the Bible says they hide in their caves. They know what's coming. Now, right here, the Senate. 
There's the House and the Senate. When are they going off? They are going off on the 22nd. Their vote is at 1 p.m. I'm assuming after they vote, they are leaving. And I think some of them are voting from home because I watched some of this hearing and there was very few people there. There was uh, very few people there. It was a committee. There was very few people there. They were distancing themselves. Some of them were seat sitting in the middle on the floor. But uh, very few. But they are taking off after this. So the Senate and the House are both gone. After the 22nd. They're on recess. As I said, my brother right here. I appreciate you. Uh, Rod's been sending me stuff. Other people have been sending me stuff. I love it. We, you know, thank you. Your comments, beautiful comments. I have brothers that give me comments. I love them all. So... I will play this in a minute. Rod gave me this. 22nd, right here. If you, uh, October 22nd, I have said this sign right here, I felt it was the greatest sign. It's the eclipse across the United States. It's right here. This is just before Passover. It's, it's the 8th. Just before Passover. The eclipse that came in 2017 was just before the Day of Atonement. Um, right here. This is Passover. Actually, when you pick in Passover, it says Day of Atonement right here. Rosh Hashanah, Day of Atonement right here. This is, this is September. This is six months later. Six months later. So on my date calculator right here, when I go back from Passover, right here, date, Passover. Oop, let's do this. Let's do this. Made a mistake. Six months, six months, it doesn't really matter. It goes. So right here, October. So if you go back three and a half years right here from Passover, as I said, times and seasons, there's two and then judgment happens. Judgment happens after, this would be when Jesus died, Passover, 2022, um, on Passover, he died on Passover, that's what I'm getting at. Um, this is the second eclipse, which I believe this is the greatest sign which, like I showed you here, it happens just before Passover as a warning. Warning. Just like Nineveh. A warning. Then Passover in 2024 is right here. So what I did is I took back. If this is the end of the tribulation, this is the beginning of the great tribulation. Doesn't really matter. Brenda says this weekend too, 17th and 18th. But it doesn't really matter. If we're gone, we're gone. But if we're still here, that's what this video is about. Right here, it'd be next week, Thursday, 22nd, 22nd, date-to-date -date calculator right here. If you go back three and a half years, this would be either the end of the tribulation or the end when Jesus returns, foot down, whatever. It doesn't matter, it's um, three and a half years. And as you can see, a time, time, times, and a half of times, there's, there, it's, it's split up. It's, it's uh, six months apart, as I've been alluding to. So, we could leave this date. High watch, high watch for me. So, I believe they're going to get out of Dodge. Also, too, the Men in Black, the Meteor Shower Orions. Right here, this is in Sirius. Sirius is in Orion. This is when the meteor shower is, and it peaks from the 21st, 20th to the 21st is peak. It's the second meteor shower in the month. The Draconids usually peaks October 7th to 6th. Dust from Haley's Comet. So, this is just information. 
it comes out of Orion. And of course, most people, when I think of this, I think of this scene right here, and I've had had this before. This is Men in Black. Warren or Orion's belt. So that was Men in Black. That's what it always reminds me of whenever I hear about something about Orion. I always I always reminds me of that movie Men in Black. Warren Orion's belt. Warren Heaven. Um, we will see. As I said, we are watching. These are just just uh, we'll see. I mean, I'm watching every day, but uh, we will see. These are the dates that I'm watching. I'm watching this weekend. Yes, I am watching this weekend. So let's get to what Rod said. This lines up with this right here, which uh, the date right here. Yes, I love you all. I hope you are all doing well. This is, uh, I'm adding this to my video. As I said, my video, I combined it because I cut some out of it. But uh, here's the date as we are watching every day. Uh, this is about the 21st to the 25th. My brother Rod sent me this. I love you, brother. If anybody wants a copy of this, this is from Dave Rogers. And uh, he said at the 50 minute mark, I could watch this whole thing, but I put it at the 51 minute mark. We have a, uh, the group of people that will be uh, spirited away, just like the helicopters, just like in the Hollywood movies, to the different bunkers and their assigned positions in case of war. That is in play at this point yeah they're not yeah. spirited way yet but they are they're getting ready to and guess what the date is i asked the date what is their window what did the alert say not the public what did the private alert say they said from the 21st to the 25th be ready because we will come to get you at the point that we have to come and get you that's a real story wow the so, 21st to the 25th Yep. October. I'm talking October. I know. So, that's the 21st to the 25th. Just as I show you right here. The 21st to the 25th. So, as I said, this is lining up. Just as I said, I showed you the them. Uh, this is the vote. This was on the 15th. This article. They said the the date was approved to vote. The most Democrats voting by proxy. So they're not even going to be there, most of them. And as I said, this, this is going to be the 22nd right here, October 22nd. As I showed you in my other part of this video, that's when they're having the, the vote. But they're voting for by proxy. And as I said this, they're going on recess, Senate. The, this is just a committee. Most senators are at home. This is the Judicial Committee. The Most of the senators at home, and in, then the, it's at 1 o'clock on the 22nd, and then they are leaving. Okay, proxy vote means they're not there. They're letting somebody vote on their behalf. So, as he said, thank you, Rod. And then this is uh, the article on it. So, as I showed in my other part of this video this is what we are watching now as I have said before in some of my other videos we are watching this weekend yep no problem we are watching up to the 31st the meteor shower is right here 20 right here the Orionids as I showed 
and uh, I hope you're all doing well. I'm going to add this to the video, and uh, like I said, we are watching every day. I hope you're all doing well. Leave comments, um, and like I said, uh, we pray that our redemption is near. We are waiting for our Lord and Savior. I love you all, and uh, like I said, you can go over these dates yourself, but... As the Bible says, I could put up these Bible verses. I might do this in my next video. It says that the kings and rulers of the earth hide in their caves. And uh, like I said, from the calendar that I showed you um, until Thanksgiving, the week before Thanksgiving, I think if we leave at Halloween right here, it's all lining up. So I love you all and we will watch and see. Thank you very much, and I hope you're all doing well. Uh, keep sending me comments, information. We all work together. We are all on the same page as my brother Rod here, and I thank my sisters send me stuff. Um, my brothers send me stuff. Um, like I said, I love you all, and I hope you're all doing well. Thank you. Bye. Yes, uh, how's everybody doing? I'm going to put this on the all of my videos now that I know how to uh, splice two videos together. I know from some of my comments, people like my Bible studies and uh, just, like I said, just information and uh, just things the Lord, like I said, I wouldn't give my testimony. The Lord wanted me to pray in my closet, in my room right here. Um... As it says, and I have said this before, when Jesus goes forth out of his chamber for his bride in her closet. This does not say the church. This says he's coming for his bride in her closet. I believe this is us. I believe this is that are following instructions and deny it not. Just like it says here in Proverbs. It says right here, blessed is the man that heareth me watching daily at the gates and at my doors. For whoever findeth me, findeth life, and obtain favor of the Lord. So, and as it says up here in Proverbs, as I've had before, it says, The Lord loves those that love Him, and those that seek Him early will find Him. Okay? So, this right here, it doesn't say He's coming for the church. He says He's coming for His bride in her closet. That's in Matthew chapter 6, as I said before. This is the Lord's Prayer, praying in your closet. And right here, also too, it says in Luke, what is said in darkness in the, in the, is heard from the light, and it's like proclaiming it on the housetops. So this is, I believe us, I also believe this is the Church of Philadelphia, which, as I'll show you right here, Matthew chapter 6, Jesus says, don't pray as the hypocrites do in the synagogues. What is he saying there? Synagogues is a church. So these are churches. This talks about the churches. All the churches in Revelations, all the churches. So in Matthew chapter 6, he does say down here, you do get a reward right here. They have their reward. But it says right down here, and then he tells about praying in secret. It says right down here, so he's comparing them. But thou, right here, in secret, the Father that sees you in secret, himself shall reward you openly, himself. It doesn't say anything negative about this. And uh, also, too, down here, it says, protect, I, as I said before, this I believe this is also Luke 21, 36. Pray always that you. You are worthy to escape all these things. It also says, give us our daily bread. Right here. Right here. I believe this is mean daily. You pray daily in secret. You're rewarded every day for praying in secret. Right here. You forgive others. Okay. Right here. This is what it says in Psalms. My voice is here in the morning. O oh Lord, I would direct my prayer unto thee and look up. In other words, every day, like I said, with the uh, Lord's Prayer. 
Now I'll go over this right here. This is Matthew. Why did Jesus, as it says here in Matthew chapter 6, Matthew chapter 6, the disciples asked Jesus, how do you pray? Okay. They said, "There, how do we pray? You know, how do we pray? That's, that's what the disciples were asking him. Well, the reason why the disciples didn't know is because what happened? Every time Jesus prayed, what did he do? Right here. When, the multi, when he sent the multitude away, he went into a mountain apart by himself in secret and prayed. And it came, the evening came and he was alone. So he prayed in secret alone just like we are. He's instructing us to do as he's done. And he's our king, our high priest. He's our savior. I could go on and on. So he's doing, he's telling you to do what he was He was. Yeah, like I have said before, I pray the Lord's Prayer in chap Luke chapter 11. Uh, as you can see right here, it talks about the synagogues, the churches, the Pharisees, the hypocrites right here, just like as it says, put your portion with the hypocrites and the non-believers. It says, row to the Pharisees, woe to the, to the Pharisees right here. Um, it, this is the synagogues right here, churches, just like I said before. Up here, I pray the Lord's Prayer. It says, forgive us of our sins. This is the version that I pray, and it's in Luke. Uh, right here, give us our daily bread. Forgive us of our sins. Um, and as I said, right here, Jesus said in John 8, 51, Verily, verily, I say unto you, anyone that keeps my saying shall never see death. Okay. Um. I don't know if you know about the story of Job. Job had favor of the Lord, okay? He had favor of the Lord. He was considered righteous. Um, God told Satan that he could not kill Job. Um, anyway, that's, if you know the story of Job, um, you know, it's... Like I said, you know the story of Job. I could go over that, but I don't have enough time right now. Like I said here in Proverbs chapter 8, we are waiting, okay? We are waiting. It says, Blessed is the man that heareth me, watching daily at my gates and at my doors, whoever findeth me find favor of the Lord. Favor. In other words, we're considered righteous, favored, favored. Because we're watching. We want to be with the Lord. The Lord wants to be with us. Just like it says up here. You love the Lord. The Lord loves you. So if you go to Revelations 2. This is the Church of Philadelphia. It says right here. Because I have kept the word of my patience. I will also keep you from the four hour of temptation that shall come upon the old world. As I have said to everybody on my channel. Go to the Lord in your closet in secret. And pray to the Lord in secret that you want to go to the wedding supper. And uh, like I said, I want to see everybody there. I want to go there. It says uh, Luke 21:36. Pray always that you are accounted worthy to escape all these things. So what I'm saying is state your case. Go in your closet. Pray daily the Lord's Prayer. I love you all. And uh, like I said, I want to, I'm going to put this on all my videos at the end. And uh, anybody new can just see it. And uh, like I said, this is what I believe the Church of Philadelphia is. Because we're waiting. Most people aren't waiting. I love you all and I hope you're all doing well. And uh, I'm going to put this on my, my video at the end. So, love you all and I hope you're all doing well. Thank you. Bye.